How's it going everyone? Wild Thang here and welcome to a brand new Destiny video. In this video I'm going to be talking to you guys about another weapon. This is now my second weapon that I've got from Crota's End and it's a lovely sniper rifle. It's a solar damage sniper rifle and it's called a Black Hammer. So let's just go through the perks and upgrades that we get. So obviously it's solar, base damage is 300. Starting off on the left here we have Ambush SLH25, Agile Snappy Scope, handles beautifully, rewards a skilled hand. Taxis SLS 15, mid zoom scope, useful for unpredictable situations. Hawkeye SLR 15, mid zoom precision scope, increased range and target, target acquisition, but it's heavy. White nail, rapidly landing three precision shots will refill the magazine. Now that's pretty good. If you can get three headshots in a row or three stomach shots on Vex in a row, then it will refill the magazine instantly, so you don't even need to reload. That will be pretty awesome, but I've not actually had it happen to me yet. Maybe in the future, but it's, I'll say it's very rare that that's going to happen. And obviously you have an upgrade to damage. Snapshot. Aiming this weapon is incredibly fast. Flared Magwell. Reload this weapon even faster. Perfect balance. This weapon has inc extremely low recoil. Mulligan. Missing a shot is a chance to return ammo directly to the magazine. Now that is also a feature available on the icebreaker. That's pretty good. So if you do miss a shot, then it just instantly goes back in the magazine, which is good because if you do, if you're low on ammo, then obviously that one bullet could make all the difference. So that's always good. So next one is upgrade to damage. Now obviously this is a Crota's End gun, so it's only rewarded when you've complete well, when you've killed Crota. That's the only way weapons drop in Crota's End. Now obviously this has got perks that are specifically for the raid. So this is called Hive Disruptor. Increased damage to Hive Majors. Now Majors are the guys that have got yellow health bars and they're, they're harder to kill. So this has got increased damage to Hive Majors. And then the last three are upgrades to damage. Now you will need Radiant Energy because it is a raid gun. So make sure you save up your raid energy. Obviously you're always going to have more energy than shards. It always happens. Like I've got, I think I've got 22 energy at the moment and 10 shards possibly. Um, but yeah, <laughs> just keep running the raid with your three characters if you have three. And you should soon be able to get enough to upgrade all your weapons. Okay, so now I'm going to show you quickly how this weapon fires and what it's kind of like and what the recoil is like. Let me just try and find some enemies that are far away. In the distance. Oosh, headshot. <laughs> ha! Um, so the only downfall to this gun that I've found so far is the fact that it's only got three bullets in the chamber or in the mag. Um, I'm used to my icebreaker, which has six, which is quite a lot for a sniper. Let me just, ooh, look at that freaking jumping around balance and agility. Ooh, another headshot. Do I get three headshots? No, oh, they're too close. <laughs> Why am I so close to them? I'm being a sniper. Ooh, yeah, I got three headshots, but the bullets did not return to the chamber or to the mag. Why do I keep chain chamber? Oh, oh, I'm annoying myself. <laughs> oh, shoot him in the back. Boop. <laughs> So as you can see, the damage on this gun is pretty high, even though I've not upgraded it that much. I don't think I've even upgraded any of the damage. Let me just check quickly, because I, I have memory like a fish. No, I've not upgraded any of the damage. So this weapon is pretty good. Compared to that No Land Beyond thing, this is getting 2,000 points of damage just on a headshot. Um, oh, Blade of Crota. Do I need this? Probably don't need <laughs> Could try and shoot him from it. Let me just reload. Where are you running to? He's like, fuck this, I'm out of here. Whoosh. Killed it. I can see spin metal in the distance. Do I? I probably don't need any more spin metal. I've got enough. That one's dead. He's dead. Because I didn't even shoot him. Oh, that completely wiped off his uh, shield. Where's he going? <laughs> He's running away. <laughs> He's scared of me. I'm going to go chase him. I'm going to get the spin metal first though. And then I'll kill him. <laughs> Where is he? 
Come here. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. No, no, stay back. There we go. Give me a snap. Give me a snip your head. There we go. Done. Oh, precision mag bonus. Yay, I got it. So because I shot that dude in the head. Oh my god, there's those coming out three times. I got the precision mag uh, bonus, which means three bullets are instantly put in the magazine, so I don't even have to reload. So that was pretty nice, even though I did still hit the reload button, but it was nice to know that I didn't have to actually reload. Uh, I don't know why I'm using my sniper on enemies that are so close, but yeah, let's just... Oh, where'd he go? I was going to try and get three shots. Oosh, there we go. Moving target as well. Can I do... Uh, let's try doing a 360 no scope. Stop running. Let me try and do this. <laughs> Ooh, oh, oh! I would have got him if he hadn't moved. You little turd. <laughs> right, let's try and find some more enemies. Play around with this weapon a little bit more because I do really like this sniper. Unfortunately, the only downfall, like I said, is the fact that it's only got three bullets in the magazine. But that's just down to personal preference. It's because I'm lazy and I'd rather have more bullets than to have to keep reloading all the time. Who's shooting at me? Oh, really? No. No. Right. Oh, where'd they go? <laughs> Damn it. Come on, guys. Work with me. I'm trying to do a weapon guide here. There we go. Trying doing the quick scoping in Destiny. With these unpredictable enemies. Yeah, that's, that's useful. Oh. Stop hiding. <laughs> Come on. Come on. You know you want to come out and play. Ooh. i got two bullets left. Let's make them count. Let's try and do something stupid. Oh. Yeah, you can't use this gun as a, as a shotgun style sniper. So yeah, this I pretty I do really like this sniper. I do use it when I'm using exotic, primary, or heavy uh, in replacement of my icebreaker. But obviously, my icebreaker does take primary slot if I'm using a, an exotic secondary or a special weapon, whatever you want to call it. Just because it does also have solar damage and it's fully upgraded to 331 damage, and obviously, ammo reloads and you don't have to. You have infinite ammo with the icebreaker, which is awesome. So anyway, guys, this has been a video for the Black Hammer. You only get this weapon through Crota's End and by killing Crota. Obviously, it's a random drop. You can get any weapon from Crota's End. It won't specifically be this one. But hopefully, you've enjoyed this video. It's given you a little bit more insight onto what the sniper rifle is like, how to use it, and all the perks. If you did enjoy this video, please do hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Reduce recoil, significant penalty to range. Soft ballistics, less recoil, but penalty to impact. Accurized ballistics, more range and impact, but increased recoil. Mulligan, missing a shot has a chance to return ammo directly to the magazine. Upgrade to damage. Light